Christ the Lord might be the crown if y'all here in honor my brother the white Danielle Deal, bringing awareness to member breast cancer. Miss Minnie Mile Walk and Run, in support of the Susan G. Coleman Cancer Walk for Cure. What's up, y'all? Hey, what's hey, up? What's up, brother? Hey, brother. For you. <laughs> what's up? This is how y'all got to do it. For you all, no one but you. All right, we love you, bro. Wait, where the captain at? You're supposed to be out here. All right, baby. Peace. Uh, Mike Vita Grande, CEO of the Backyard Committee. We're spending our walk and run in honor of my brother, the white Danielle Deal, bringing awareness to men with breast cancer. Well, big brother, it's day number 55 for me. I'm out here, man, in honor of you supporting Susan G. Coleman. Walk for a Cure Foundation. I know you've been doing it for the last 15 years, but the day I'm out here is my first year. Thanks to you, I'm out here, bro. You know what I'm saying? And it feels great. You know what I'm saying? I got the family out here with me. I got Javon and Sandy, Erica, Michael, Brother Ray, the kids, little Michael. So we all out here, man, getting ready to do this whole thing. You know what I'm saying? It's team deal, baby. So this is where we at, man. This is really the energy out here is so nice, you know. And so you can ready to walk. We got the Indians out here, bro. You know. So like I said, man, do something for somebody, man. You know, and, and, and just and just feel great about doing it. You know what I'm saying? So, but like I said, man, y'all just keep doing what you're doing and. And we keep supporting and coming together, man, you know? Mike Gitter Brown, see all the backyard committee. Team deal, baby. Let me see that banner right there. Hold that banner up for me. Team deal, we got you, homie. We got you. We at home, checking it out. We got you, my brother. Love you, dude. Never so up out here. That was not funny, man. I'm really enjoying this here. It's a nice slow walk, but hey, it's good not to my normal pace, you know. So I just take it easy. I'm gonna get a gun and see what a bad girl can do. Take it here behind me. See that right there? My brother at the Fonica. Hold it up. Little piece. Yeah, look at our deal. You're in this thing, baby. You out here? You represent it. Yeah, that's the double D's, yeah. Shout out to any and everybody who's gone through something, got cancer, no matter what it be. We all have things that we go through in life, so we just got to get out here and support. This is the real deal, not only cancer, this is more than just cancer. This is about people coming together and sharing a common interest and just getting along in harmony, you know? What we doing, baby? We just out here. All right. We are bouncing for a cure, baby. That's where we at right now. And now we're doing it in New Orleans. We bounced it out. Hey everybody, as you're crossing the finish line, turn left, there's Matt Gatto, Liz Leos from Channel 8. Say hi ladies! Hi, hi. 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 
Good job, everybody. Come on in. You're done with the one mile race. Hey, keep moving through now. Do not delay. We got lots of folks behind you. Move through all the way around the track. Keep moving. Keep moving. Make sure you stop for some water there at the pink Kentwood Bridge. Here you go, baby. Across the finish line on me. That's how we do it out here. All right. I'll get my medal with my medal. I'm a 5K finisher. Oh, okay. All right, 5K finisher. All right. Oh, well. I make my own medal then. I ain't mad with them. All right. I know you need the walk, big boy. Where we need them at? Right there. Oh, that's a good boy. What's up, homie? Boy, you better be walking around here. But Should my be... leg hurts. Oh, yeah, my leg hurt too. Should be carrying your mama. All right. You're broken down and tired. You're living life on the merry-go-round. And you can't find a fighter. I see it in you, so we can walk it out. Move mountains. We can walk it out and move mountains. And I'll rise up, I'll rise like the day. I rise up, I rise unafraid. I rise up, and I. Silence is it quiet And it feels like it's getting hard to breathe And I know you feel like dying But I promise we'll take the world to its feet Move I won't take Bring it to its feet I feel that God is blessing me with a message. So what I did is I decided, I'm going to put this out here. I'm going to write. I'm not going to be private about cancer. I'm going to put it out here. And I can promise you, I exaggerate not, that if I have received, going toward 200 in inboxes from people who have suffered through this, this horrific disease, this monster has stricken, or stricken somebody very close to him, if I haven't spoken to 200 people, I haven't spoken to anyone. And that testimony, that testimony is empowering. That testimony is enriching. That testimony tells you that you're not in the fight alone. And the most, the thing that they told me when they wrote was, hey, I'm so glad somebody said it, because me and my family are dealing with it, and we didn't want to bore other people or put other people in that situation. And I said, man, I know my son. I know my friends, I know the people that I hang around, I know the people that I, I, I associate with, and if I tell them, they're not going to be bored. I mean, I know some good people, and, and a lot of them are in here, and a lot of them couldn't make it, but a lot of them are in here, and, and everybody in here is good people that I know, but I mean, a lot of the good people that I know are just happen to be here, and of course, I appreciate it, but all the testimonies that came out of, out of my plight and publicizing it, has made me feel like I'm back in charge of it. I love being people who know me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> me yeah. I ain't really much of a follower. I ain't really much of a follower. Uh, I, I, like to, I, like to, I like to light the torch. And I, I'm not the first one with cancer. And I'm not going to be the last one with cancer. Amen, amen. But I bet you one thing, I'm going to fight it. And then whoever gets it, 
And if I find on the bottom, I'm going to be in their ear and tell them, pity party, cancer. Pity party, cancer. Thank you all for coming. My sisters, my brothers, my family, my friend, all of my friends, my, my old buddies from the days back, from the club. I got people in here from the club to church to work to everything. See, that's what I'm saying. Seven grades. I mean, right. Uh, uh, Anybody arrested here?